line come forward and they're just about tucked away. This is a fifth grade over the shorts. A little bit of cloud cover here for the penultimate. Bandit Bluey, our favourite first up. All set with the green jacket. They're ready. They're racing. Bandit Bluey second out. Kays and Shadow beat him to the first punch up to three. Authentic. Deep was Ragnall Waltz. Then Spring Feature there followed then by Spring Oliver. Getting back then was Self Sink and a Slick Soldier around the carousel. Kays and Shadow and Bandit Bluey. Now the gears kick in and Bandit Bluey races away from Kays and Shadow. Authentic three. Spring Feature four. Then out wide we had Slick Soldier. Further back in the run was Ragnall Waltz. Spring Oliver, self sink, there's no more. It is a slick run, 1959. Bandit Bluey, that'll give the Lords a treble. 220 at 130 interim, three dollars across on Uni Tab, Kays and Shadow 240 and authentic. One of the bolters there, $14. 654 and 3. Interim result, 11 Golden Grays, 6543, 1959, and it's a three-length buffer. And six and a quarter between second and third, all clear and other details down the line. Bandit Bluey, nice return to racing. A blue bitch by collision out of Opal Rocks. Jody Lord for Joe Lanuti. Pretty happy with that, Joseph. He's uh, she's back with a bang. Five from eight. Five yellow Kazan Shadow, Chloe Bilal for the Kazan Dynasty Syndication, managed by Jay Kurtz, Superior Panama Exciting, and third to four, the Blue Authentic, Derek Kerr, Robert Bean. So it's 654 and three. 654 and three. 1959, best of the day by a country mile there. 1328, run home. 1328. Three by six and a quarter, six five four three, nineteen fifty nine after the running of race eleven. Let's go to the last. And Nordic Inferno at two dollars forty. Tears to cheers on the second line at three dollars, and the race is due in fourteen. <laughs> 